One of the best ways to add value to your home is with new flooring, but how do you pick the best choice for your aesthetic and your budget? Michael Patino from High Tech Flooring and Design is here to keep us on track with that. Hey, Michael, how are you? I'm great, great. Thanks for having me back. Absolutely. So what is a way we can add value to our home? You know, the, the probably the, the flooring product that adds the most value is hardwood floors. Mm -hmm. If you're talking to a realtor and she's advertising your home, um, he or she is advertising your home, they uh, would generally not advertise that there's you know, new carpeting or new yeah. tile or whatever but definitely hardwood floors. You always is, hear that. Yeah. Absolutely. And so it just changes the feel of the entire mm -hmm. house. Uh, so I would say that that's the, the one product that you can put in that will truly add value mm -hmm. uh, to your home. Now, if we can't, if, I know there's a variety of price ranges, yeah. but if we can't do hardwoods, what are other options? You know, one thing, hardwoods come in a wide, like you said, a wide variety of price points. So you can actually add uh, uh, hardwoods to your home for as little as six dollars six fifty a mm -hmm. foot uh, fully installed that goes up to quite a bit uh, higher than that but I would say that most hardwood flooring gets installed in a home uh, somewhere in the seven to ten dollars and fifty cents a foot range mm -hmm. so that's kind of a budget that people can use um, if that's something that's above their budget um, w probably the least expensive way to do it is, is through new carpeting mm -hmm. um, if you're selling your house uh, there is always this debate of whether or not we should let the person that's buying your mm -hmm. house change the carpeting out but I would yeah. think that most people would uh, advise you to put new carpeting in the home and really that can be done for you know, as little as a dollar fifty a foot mm -hmm. um, fully installed in your home and it really does you know make a, a nice yeah. impression when it's all when it's all completely this done. cleans it up because even in those absolutely. high traffic spots where you clean and clean you sometimes can't get it out absolutely so yeah absolutely so, so carpeting would be I think the the, the next best, the next yeah. best choice. Now, uh, back to the hardwoods. If we did do hardwoods, do you recommend doing it in the main areas or the whole house, like bedrooms too? Yeah, we're seeing hardwood right now in more and more rooms of the house. Uh -huh. The only rooms that are sort of, we're not seeing it in would be like the utility room, right. maybe the master bathroom. Uh, a lot of people have questions of whether or not to put it in the kitchen. Uh, the way the finishes are on hardwood floors now, they're very, very durable to uh, little water spills mm -hmm. and stuff like that. So there's not really a danger of that. I've got no problem um, yeah. advising to put it in kitchens and, and a lot of the main areas. Okay. Speaking so, yeah. of kitchens, you know, I always hear kitchens and bathrooms are like the way, if you're going to redo something Absolutely. or update something, that's where we should do it. Do you agree? Absolutely. Master bathroom for sure, uh, the kitchen for sure. Um, you know, new countertop and new kitchen backsplash can just change the whole look of the mm -hmm. kitchen. Um, and then in a uh, master bathroom, you know, the renovations can be a, a bit extens uh, extensive, but uh, there's truly value in taking maybe an old tub combination shower tub thing mm -hmm. and, and turning it into a full stand-up shower yeah. and there's there's a uh, there's quite a bit of value in, in doing that you might so. like it so much you decide you don't want to move that's exactly <laughs> we see that a lot actually we see that a lot yeah. so yeah you guys can help people configure you know whatever design yep. and also you know, pricing levels, budgets, choices. Absolutely. Yeah. We have a number of flooring consultants that will kind of take you through what your goals are, what your budget is, how long you think you're going to be in the home. Is this just to fix it up to sell it or is it something that you're going to, um, you know, maybe decide to live there for another 10, 12 years. Mm -hmm. And so we can kind of help you through that, uh, through that equation. And you can yeah. deliver samples to the homes too. Absolutely. We'll bring products out to you. We've got a 10,000 square foot showroom that if you want to uh, come in and browse, some people that's a little bit overwhelming. Mm -hmm. We need to kind of narrow the choices down. Yeah. And so we'll bring a designer out to the house and get a feel for what your house looks like awesome. and then uh, advise you from there. Thank yeah. you so much. Always yeah. great stuff. Thanks, Michael. Absolutely. And you can stop by High Tech Flooring and Design at 2510 Rutland Drive or go to htflooringanddesign.com for more information.